I am a woman. So what? I get into an argument with a man. He slaps me. I feel the pain, yet they'll tell me I provoked him. I should have been quiet. I should have been patient. I should apologize to him. I get into an argument with a man. I slap him. They tell me I have no respect, no home training. I should have been quiet. I should have been patient. I should apologize to him because I'm a woman. I don't have a right to be angry. So the degree of my innocence is directly proportional to the degree of my silence in the face of oppression and brutality. Because I'm a woman, my husband cheats on me. I'm told to tolerate it to save my marriage. The barbaric and stupid excuse is that it is in the nature to cheat. I should slim down, dress better, cook better, pray harder, and be more pleasant to him. I cheat, and I'm called a whore. I have committed an abomination. I have no right to look elsewhere for the love and emotional support I lack at home. I am an irresponsible mother. So I am sent packing from the home we both built with all my earthly possessions stuffed into a tiny box on my head. I am henceforth forbidden from seeing my two older children. I'm lucky to be allowed to go with my little one still sucking on my left breast. Three years later, the little one is tagged a bastard. Now, my new name is After Tree because I am a woman. He is 28 and runs a company. He starts wonderful, hardworking, focused, career oriented, successful at a very young age. I'm 28. I run a company. Hmm, she's not even married or serious. Cannot order her priorities right. A hustler loves money. Let her go and get a husband. Oh, and I wonder if being successful has anything to do with a person's gender. Because I'm a woman, I'm not allowed to, to have wits or be a prodigy. I cannot be financially buoyant, professionally successful, or be treated with respect without a man beside me. Then I'm tagged a, a generous leg opener, a runs girl. They never see the possibility that I actually have to go through ups and downs to get to where I am because I am a woman. A man loses his wife to death and remarries a year after. He did the right thing. He's been praised, congratulated for moving on after after all, life is for the living. A woman loses her husband to death, remarries after four years. Aha, so early? Are you sure she wasn't sleeping with that man even when her husband was alive? That was why she killed her husband. She's a witch because she's a woman. Because I'm a woman, this post will be considered controversial. And everyone will try to correct me. But don't forget that I am a woman. And it does not make me less woman. Share to respect some woman and tell your mother that you love her. Who is a woman? When she's quiet, millions of things are running through her mind. When she stares at you, she's wondering why she loves you so much. It's part of being taken for granted. When she says, I will stand by you, she will stand by you like a solid rock. Never hurt her or take her for granted. A very heart-touching message by a woman. Someone asks her, are you a working woman or a housewife? She replied, yes, I am a full-time working housewife. I work 24 hours a day. I'm a mom, I'm a wife, I am a daughter, I am a daughter-in-law, I am a lamb clock, I am a cook, 
I am a maid. I am a teacher. I am a waitress. I am a nanny. I am a nurse. I am a handywoman. I am a security officer. I am a counselor. I am a comforter. I don't get holidays. I don't get sick leave. I don't get day off. I walk you day and night. I am on call all hours and get paid with a sentence. What do you do all day? This is dedicated to all women. A woman has the most unique character like such. Her presence is never remembered, but her absence makes all the things tasteless. Pass it all to the lovely ladies, your mother, your wife, your daughter, your sister, your friend. Forward to every woman to make her smile. Share to every woman to make her smile. And to every man to make him realize a woman's worth. Thank you.